Glass out, knives. The knives mystery. Roll the intro. Welcome back, guys. We are back with another movie. This one is for Knives Out 2. Um, I'm really excited for this. Um, guys, you know, um, we, uh, we did the first Knives Out, and it was, I think, this Monday. Um, I'm really excited to see more and see where this goes. So, uh, let's just hop right into this. Three, two, one. Yeah. What? I love you. That was a babe. Get back. Why does everyone like looking at her like what? That is okay. No, I didn't. You sent me a shot. Get on the road outside your hand. You sent a tape of this. I'm caught it. Oh. Yeah. Right. Deceptive. The Miles Bond Golden Suit. Damn! <laughs> Shots fired? Shots fired. Ready? We're gonna drop the mic. Whoa! What? The whole glass onion. Covered by tears. Oh my god. That one. Now, I believe trophy section will reveal some sort of remote trickery. Turning off the light. Oh. Some. Oh, we do. Here goes number one. <laughs> Someone was trying to kill you. <laughs> okay. No! So that's why Annie. So that's why. That's why she went. Right here. I'm gonna use it to burn this whole empire down. I need to know one last chance to make things right. Okay. I'm proposing that you come with me to that island. <gasps> Woo! Yes. They were all friends with Andy. Birdie was a wife. What do you mean, come with me? I want. Damn. Damn. I did it. Who is to say I did it? Okay? We need to focus. We need to focus. We need to find the O. I almost got in an accident on his motorcycle. He was driving so fast. And we almost got parked. Okay, okay. Okay. Can you say all that one more time? Right. Yeah. What the fuck must have screwed me up in my brain? Just take me. Wow. This has never happened before. <gasps> he missed. <laughs> I did. a I expected a lot of craziness. Stop. <laughs> Just tell us. Who tried to kill me? Ready, that's amazing. This, this. He gave. Struck by. In fact, he told all. Right out in the open, he told it. I can't. It. Oh, 
we all were thinking that maybe it wasn't Miles. They always pointed it and not at Miles, but apparently he did it. No pineapple, no, right? Please don't dance with pineapple. Ho ho! The real gun on the table and turning off the light. Okay, but second. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Dude, the Django on chain right here with the with the ended. <laughs> So, I'm gonna talk about everything about this movie. This, the cinematography, everything. Like, it, it just went down to the wire. Everything was great. Like, I loved everything that they did. I loved the flashbacks. I didn't care how long they were. This movie deserved the two hours and 20 minutes it got. Because, to... Reveal all of that, it definitely needed that length. It ne definitely needed that length. And it was worth it. Uh, do you, do I think that movies are getting a little bit long? Correct. I do think movies are getting a little bit long sometimes. Um, A three hour movie is getting a little bit crazy. There is extended editions of movies. There is... um, a uh, crazy big gigantic movies and I just don't like that as much as the next guy. I like a long movie, but sometimes not every long thing needs to be long. There's certain movies that deserve its length. Um now this movie, yes, it deserves its length. Um uh I don't know, man. It's it's a really great mystery um and when it comes down to mysteries you know me i'm really good at them um i, I can figure out uh stuff really like fast if i put all the pieces together um uh um so um but there's a lot of uh things that are out there where uh, I would love to do theory videos, um, for movies, or TV shows, personally, TV shows, um, but I really love a good mystery, and this mystery had me puzzled, it really did, from the moment it started to the end, I didn't know who it was, I couldn't figure it out, because the problem was there were so many twists and turns and there were so many plot twists that I didn't want to actually look for the answer because there was too many clues to find, to figure out, and to play, place in a little jigsaw masterpiece of some sort. Um, so, uh, I don't know, man. Without further ado, this was Knives Out, uh, to, uh, this is a 10 out of 10. I don't think I ever have given something a 10 out of 10 unless it was Stranger Things 4. Um, this is a masterpiece in the making. Um, they did a fantastic job. There were some 
parts of the movie that I didn't like. There were some, um, like, nuances that were just a little bit, uh, okay. Um, but throughout all in all, great movie. Fantastic. Um, I, I can't, get, like, diminish the rating just because of some of the nuances that were, they were small, small parts. And it was not that bad at all. There was really good moments. There was really bad moments. There was, uh, there, it was all beyond a great movie and a mass, masterpiece. I, uh, I don't know. Like, this is going to definitely get a want, I think. But I don't think it's going to be in the running this year. I feel like it will be in the running next year, maybe. Because it's really late. Um, it could be in the running this year since it was released a month ago. I don't know how that works. Um, but it does have a great supporting cast. Um, it has an all-star cast of characters and people from many different medias that you all know. Daniel Craig is uh, James Bond um, or the James Bond that is not James Bond anymore. Um, and then they got, and then they got Edward Norton this time. There's a new, whole new cast of characters for, from the first one. They got Edward Norton from, um, the old Incredible Hulk, which is the Incredible Hulk movie. It was not Ruff, Mark Ruffalo, it's the second Hulk. Um, and then they got, um, uh, what else? They got, um, Kate Hudson. Um, she, she's in, like, all the romantic comedies, probably, so, I, I don't know a lot about her, I don't, I don't, I've never seen a lot of her movies. I know her name, because of, her name is, like, popular out there in the media, um, just because of who she is, and her name, I don't know why, it's, it's always said, said out there. Um, if, like, it's just, the name is familiar. Um... Uh, they had a new cast of, um, Matt, Madeline, I, I don't know if I'm saying that right, Madeline Queen, I'm gonna have to really look her up, uh, you gotta give me credit, guys, um, I didn't, never seen Outer Banks, I wanted to t check it out, it's on my list, <laughs> um, uh, um, Dave, from the the Guardians of the Galaxy, they got Catherine Hine, um, as in uh uh the the girl that is uh Agatha did it all along, if you know what I mean. Um, she's in a lot of movies before that, so um and TV shows, but I mean she's been in a lot of movies before that Marvel. Cinematic Universe appearance, but I know her from that. Um, and then basically, uh, uh, those I know the girl that played um Andy from somewhere, but I can't put my name on it. But I don't know the guy that played um the guy that played uh what. Where's the, 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 um, okay, I don't know this guy, yeah, I have no idea who this is, nope, not a clue, I don't know anything about Leslie, Odom Jr. Lionel, Lionel, Lionel. I I have no idea. Um, I know a lot about her from something. Her name is familiar too. Who is she? Who is she? Who is she? Who is she? Oh, she's in a lot of soundtracks, but she is she an actress in a lot of stuff? Huh. No.
yeah, her name just sounds familiar to me. Sorry, but uh, but the girl that played Andy and Helen just sounds familiar. Um, but that's about it for you guys. Uh, I know you probably tuned off by that now, but anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next night. Um, Knives Out video, if there is any Knives Out movies. I know there's a sequel coming out. Um, and, um, I'll see you guys just in general for a next video. I have, uh, Supernatural, um, to be recorded tonight. It probably will not go up for a little bit, but, uh, stay tuned for that. Um, I also am putting up Fake Sex Education tonight, season three, episode two, one, and three, season three, episode one and two. Uh, um, not probably tonight, first episode two, but I will be putting up the first one. Uh, stay tuned for that, and, um, because I, I want to get Knives Out up. Um, if I can't get Knives Out up, um, it will be put up Saturday because of, uh, copyright claims. I don't know what's going to be the, 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 the deal because this is a newer movie. I know it might be a little bit harder to get up. And I definitely want to put a lot more of this movie in than, um, what I did for the first one. I don't know if I did the first one that long. I think I did it at 15 minutes, but... Um, it turned out to be, like, seven, so I kind of wanted to get it to nine if I can, or ten. Um, we tried Black Adam at ten or eleven, and it just failed, so, uh, we're, we have to be careful, um, uh, to avoid that. But, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.